Hello students, my name is Omlan. Today I am going to explain an electrochemical cell. So it is one of the very important topics of electrochemistry. First of all, we have to define an electrochemical cell. So an electrochemical cell may be defined as an arrangement which can convert chemical energy into electrical energy through a spontaneous chemical reaction. Termine electrochemical cell at a sotosputo rochionic bicar zoriote, rochionic hoctic, bidut hoctile, rupanto ito quivope. So after the half cells, the next important part of an electrochemical cell is the salt bridge. So salt bridge is a U shaped tube containing a salt solution like KCL, that means potassium chloride, to maintain electrical neutrality between the electrolytic solutions. I mean, I know electrochemical cell is a half cell, that is oxidation half cell, that is reduction half cell. An electrochemical cell consists of two half cells or redox couples. One of them is called oxidation half cell and the other one is called Reduction half cell. But the two of our salt bridge will be a salt bridge to give us a U shaped tube. U2 is a tube. The salt bridge is like this. So this tube connects the two half cells. That means, suppose this one is oxidation half cell and this one is. Reduction half cell. This tube is acting like a bridge and it contains a salt solution like KCL, KCL solution. So it is called salt bridge. Here, function of the salt details for him the salt bridge to kill use in an electrochemical cell. This is important kotha. The electrochemical <coughs> cell are got both the electrolytic cell to confuse kore. electrolytic cell. Actually, electrolytic cell is completely different from electrochemical cell. Electrochemical cell are chemical energy, electrical energy le convert kora hai. Aru electrolytic cell are electrical energy, chemical energy le convert kora hai. So don't confuse electrochemical cell with electrolytic cell. It is completely different and in this video we will only consider the electrochemical cells, not these electrolytic cells. Now we will discuss an electrochemical cell by taking an example which is called Daniel cell. But before going to this Daniel cell, I would like to tell you one thing that electrochemical cells are also known as galvanic or voltaic cells. Ramane electrochemical cell black of galvanic cell ba voltaic cell blue. Now we'll move on to the Daniel cell. Generally, when we represent an electrochemical cell, we draw the oxidation half cell on the left hand side and reduction half cell on the right hand side. Here, this is the oxidation half cell, this is the reduction half cell. So, we have to look at the oxidation half cell. So, we have definitely oxidation half cell. And we have to look reduction half cell. So, we definitely Reduction hobo. Yat zaron hobo. Or yat bizaron hobo. But again, zaron or bicrat yat ki hobo. Zinc solid. Send this to zinc 2 plus ion equus plus 2 electrons. The two yadidal electrode assay. He electrode dal al zinc electrode. I mean zinc or ho hot. Electrode dal bonaisu. But again, zinc or yat oxidation hobo. Mane zinc or zaron hobo. 
the zinc atoms present in this electrode will sense to zinc 2 plus ion in aqueous solution. Terminaki hobo, yazikin is zinc atom asse, the TMO is zinc electrode dal, copper electrode logot connect corridim, the Tiaki hobo, yet toka zinc atom kini, zinc 2 plus ion hoi, a solution ole, namiahibo. Yat zinc hoi asile, elegita namiahibo, tiahi, zinc 2 plus hoi namiahibo, aria duta electron, tuahibo. So zinc solid in the electrode sends to zinc 2 plus ions in aqueous solution plus two electrons these two electrons are left behind in the electrode etugami oxidation will kele kolu because there is an increase in oxidation number zinc or oxidation number on the left hand side is zero and here on the right hand side this plus two therefore oxidation number is increasing in this reaction therefore zinc undergoes oxidation in this half cell similarly if we see the reduction half cell reduction half cell to amar copper electrode ase aru copper sulfate solution ase now since it is a reduction half cell so here copper 2 plus ions will undergo reduction to copper that means the copper 2 plus ion which are present in the solution will sense to copper by taking two electrons that means ki hobo left hand side or oxidation half cell to jeneke zinc atom kini zinc 2 plus ion le convert hoisile yat tar opposite to hobo mars jitu amar solution he solution to ki ase copper 2 plus ase he copper 2 plus kini Electrodal le uthi jabo aur uthi ko play ki hobo hi copper solid le convert hobo. Kena ko convert hobo? Karon yad zinc atom kini zinc two plus ion hoy jitya nami ahi sile zinc two plus ion hoy jitya nami ahi sile. He protein two zinc atom me duta ko electron tar area ahi sile. He duta electron a wire dal le goye jitya copper electron dal palenge. तेतिया की होबो, सोल्यूशन आट थोका कोपार 2 प्लास आयन की निये, हे इलेक्ट्रोन की टाल होई पेले, की होबो ही कोपार ले कौन भार्ट होबो. So, in this half cell, कोपार 2 प्लास आयन्स will take 2 electrons and convert to solid कोपार. That means, this कोपार 2 प्लास आयन्स will go up and will deposit on the कोपार इलेक्ट्रोन. So, it is a reduction reaction will be because there is a decrease in oxidation number. Here, oxidation number comes from plus 2 in this part, copper is in plus 2 oxidation state to copper 0. So, this is a reduction reaction. So, as we see, on the left hand side, there is an increase in oxidation number from 0 to plus 2 of zinc. So this is oxidation and therefore this half cell is called oxidation half cell and on the right hand side copper changes from plus 2 to 0 state. That means here oxidation number is decreasing from plus 2 to 0. Therefore this particular reaction is a reduction reaction and therefore this half cell is known as reduction half cell. It is the zinc or oxidation from 0 to plus 2 or copper or reduction from plus 2 to 0. Tramana ki hoise zinc hini the reaction to continue hoi thakibo. He continue hoi thakute zinc hini zinc 2 plus hoi solution hoi hoi thakibo. Aru copper 2 plus hini copper hoi solution hoi pra upole uthi hoi thakibo. After some time, the concentration of zinc 2 plus ions will increase in the solution. Karan, here zinc is zinc 2 plus ion. And at the same time, concentration of copper 2 plus ions will decrease in this solution. 
कारण कपार टू प्लस आयन खी कपार हो ऊपर उठी गई आज जिंक जिंक टू प्लास हुए तल नाम और कपार टू प्लास कपार हो ऊपर उठी गई आज गति के लेफ्ट हेण्ड सडर जी जिंक सालफेट सल्यूशन आसे सी सल्यूशन तो जिंक टू प्लास कन्सेनट्रेशन और अरिजिनेलि सालफेटर कन्सेनट्रेशन एस ओ फोर टू निगेटिवर कन्सेनट्रेशन समान आज कि रियेक्शन तो कन्टिन्यू होता कि हम जिंकर कन्सेनट्रेशन बाढ़ गई थक सालफेटर कन्सेनट्रेशन कमी कमी गई थे कि हम ये सल्यूशन तो इतना एट निट्रेल सल्यूशन हो नाथ कारण इतना प्लास आयन बेसि गए माइनास आयन कमी गई से सीमिलारलि इन दिस सल्यूशन कन्सेनट्रेशन अफ कपार टू प्लास आयस उल गो ऑन डिक्रिजिंग एंड एट द सेम टाइम रिलेटिव कन्सेनट्रेशन अफ सालफेट टू निगेटिव उल गो ऑन इनक्रिजिंग गति के सल्यूशन तो कि हम इतना निट्रेल हो नाथ सो टू मेक इट निट्रेलाइज उ हेव टू यूज द सल ब्रीज जी अलग आगे पढ़ी आँ सल ब्रीज सो सल ब्रीज इज ए यूज शेप ट्यूब कनेक्टिंग द टू हाफ सेल्स सो एडाल एडाल सल ब्रीज इतना के सी एल पटेसियम क्लोराइडर एट सल्यूशन लैसो और जैसे ये सल्यूशन दूटा निट्रेल हो इयन खी नामी ना कि इतना जिंक टू पजिटिवर कन्सेनट्रेशन बाढ़ जा टू मेक इट निट्रेलाइज इले कि हम निगेटिव आयन खी नामी देट मीनस फ्रम द के सी एल सल्यूशन सी एल माइनास आयस उल कम डाउन टू दल्यूशन एंड एट द सेम टाइम जी राइट हेण्ड सडर जी सल्यूशन सल्यूशन तो कपार टू प्लास कन्सेनट्रेशन कमी गई से कारण कपार टू प्लास कपार ले कन्भार्ट गए सल्यूशन तो प्लास आयन कमी गई से गति के सडे कि हम आम सल ब्रीज डाल के प्लास आयन खी तल नामी सो दिस सल ब्रीज इज यूज टू मेन्टेन द इलेक्ट्रो निट्रेलिटी इन दिस इलेक्ट्रोलैटिक सल्यूशन नाउ सी अक्सीडेशन टेक्स प्लेस इन दिस पार्ट एंड रिडक्शन टेक्स प्लेस इन दिस पार्ट देट मीनस इन दिस पार्ट जिंक इज चेन्जिंग टू जिंक टू प्लास एंड इन दिस पार्ट कपार टू प्लास आयस आर कन्भार्टेड टू कपार देट मीनस वेन जिंक एटम्स इन दिस इलेक्ट्रड आर कन्भार्टेड टू जिंक टू प्लास टू इलेक्ट्रन्स आर लेफ्ट बिहड so when we connect these two electrodes these two electrons will move in this way to the copper electrode and in this electrode copper 2 plus ions from the solution will take up these two electrons to convert into solid copper that means this copper ions will deposit as copper on this electrode गति के देखिल इलेक्ट्रन्स आर मुविंग फ्रम लेफ्ट टू राइट इन दिस सेल देफर कारेन्ट मास फ्लो फ्रम राइट टू लेफ्ट इन दिस सेल गति केल तो कारेन्ट सोफाल बाँफाल गति और इलेक्ट्रन बिले बाँफाल सोफाल गति गए गुण पटेसियल सोर्स व्यवहार नक केमिकल रियेक्शन सहाय कारेन्ट प्रड्यूस पारिशेट मीनस यूजिंग देल उ केन प्रड्यूस इलेक्ट्रिकल एनार्जी बै सम स्पन्टेनियास केमिकल रियेक्शन द केमिकल रियेक्शनस इन द टू हाफ सेल्स आर स्पन्टेनियास बिकज उव नट यूज एनी पटेसियल सोर्स इतना पटेसियल कोर्स यूज कर ना गति के गलभेनोमिटार लग दिया तैयार तुम तक कारेन्ट देख पाबा फ्रम दिस कपार इलेक्ट्रड टू दिंक इलेक्ट्रड नाम टर्म पा हम एनड एट हम कैथड इतना यह जीडाल जिंक इलेक्ट्रड आ जिंक इलेक्ट्रडडाल आम इतना एनड भी कम 
और कपार इलेक्ट्रोडालक कैथड बी कैसा एक्सुअल एनड इज द इलेक्ट्रड एट हुईज अक्सीडेशन टेक्स प्लेस एंड कैथड इज द इलेक्ट्रड एट हुईज रिडक्शन टेक्स प्लेस सो इन दिस सेल अक्सीडेशन इज टेकिंग प्लेस इन जिंक इलेक्ट्रोड एंड रिडक्शन इज टेकिंग प्लेस इन कपार दे फोर जिंक इज एक्टिंग लाइक एनड एंड कपार इज एक्टिंग लाइक कैथड इन दिस सेल दिस इज पार्टिकुलारलि फर डेनियल सेल बेलेग सेल जो लं तीन तक जिंक और कपार नाथ पे तक हम कपार सिल्भार पे जिंक सिल्भार पे जिको कंडक्टिंग मेटेरियल थे बट पार्टिकुलारलि फर डेनियल सेल उलवेज यूज जिंक एंड कपार जिंक इन दक्सीडेशन हाफ सेल एंड कपार इन दिडक्शन हाफ सेल नाउ आम कि देखिल जिडाल जिंक इलेक्ट्रोड आ जिंक इलेक्ट्रोडाल हेन द रिएक्शन टेक्स प्लेस देन टू इलेक्ट्रन्स आर लेफ्ट बिहाइंड सिन्स इलेक्ट्रन्स आर निगेटिवली चार्ज पार्टिकल सो दिस इलेक्ट्रन इज निगेटिव देट मीन्स दिस एनड इज निगेटिव एंड इन दपार इलेक्ट्रोड कपार टू प्लास आयस आर डिपजिटेड सो एज द पजिटिव आयस get deposited on this electrode therefore this copper electrode is positive that means we have seen that in an electrochemical cell the electrode at which oxidation takes place is the anode and is always negative and the electrode at which reduction takes place is called cathode and is always positive this is for इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल जो अक्सीडेशन है इलेक्ट्रोडाल सदा एनड बी कौ और निगेटिव है और जिडाल इलेक्ट्रोडत रिडक्शन हम सक आम कैथड बी कौ और सीडाल सदा पजिटिव हम सो इन एन इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल एनड इज अलवेज निगेटिव एंड कैथड इज अलवेज और डेफिनेशन क्या के दिन The anode is the electrode at which oxidation takes place, and cathode is the electrode at which reduction takes place. You can remember the first letter of cathode is C, and the first letter of reduction is R. Both are consonant alphabets. And in other case, the first letter of anode is A, and the first letter of oxidation is O. Both are vowel alphabets. So anode, oxidation, cathode, reduction. Now we can determine the overall reaction taking place in this cell. So how can you determine the overall reaction? We can determine the overall reaction by combining the oxidation half cell reaction and reduction half cell reaction if we add these two reactions then we will get the overall reaction because this is the half of the reaction this is the other half of the reaction so if we sum up both the reactions then we will find the overall reaction taking place in this cell so the overall reaction will be zn solid plus copper 2 plus aqueous changes to जिंक टू प्लास एक्वास प्लास कपार सलिड सो दिस इज दल रिएक्शन अब दिस सेल नो इफ यू क्लोजलि अबजार्व दिस रिएक्शन यू उल सी देट इट इज नथिंग बट ए रेडक्स रिएक्शन बिकज दक्सीडेशन नम्बर अब जिंक इज इनक्रीजिंग फ्रम जिरो टू From zero to plus two, that means zinc is oxidized in the overall reaction, and the oxidation number of copper is decreasing from plus two to zero. That means copper is getting reduced in the reaction. That means a part of the reaction is oxidation, and another part of the reaction is reduction. 
so you can say that this overall reaction is a redox reaction that means it involves both oxidation and reduction a overall reaction to the two zaron ase aru bizaron ase zinc or yeah zaron ghoti se aru copper or bizaron ghoti se ghoti ke it will be a redox bikya next we see the cell representation that means how we represent an electrochemical cell ami eta electrochemical cell kene koi represent korim eta electrochemical cell represent koribo karone hodai left side e oxidation half cell represent kora hoy aru right hand side e reduction half cell represent kora hoy since in a daniel cell zinc is getting oxidized and copper is getting reduced so here from zinc this is a slash then zinc 2 plus aqueous then we have to draw two lines parallel lines so this part is oxidation and this part is reduction so in the reduction part copper 2 plus then we have to draw a line then again copper so this is in solid so zinc solid is oxidized to zinc 2 plus in aqueous then to parallel lines copper 2 plus aqueous then a line then copper solid that means this part is oxidation half cell and this part is oxidation this part is reduction half cell that means it is the overall cell representation of the electrochemical cell now the cell potential of this daniel cell is found to be 1.1 volt it is cell potential cell potential is also known as electromotive force but it is written as electromotive force only when no current is drawn through the cell now we see what happens when an electrochemical cell is connected to an external source of potential ramane jodi ami eta electrochemical cell external potential source that means ami jodi eta battery logot connect kori du tetia ki hobo eta ami tinta case dekhi bole pam case 1 when cell potential is greater than external voltage we have already seen that cell potential of daniel cell is 1.1 volt suppose we connect a battery of 1 volt so that its potential is lower than that of the electrochemical cell then the direction of current remains the same that means agote ami jitu direction of current pai asilu he eketa direction ot ami current pam jetia cell potential to external voltage ot koi beshi hobo tetia direction of current or kono change no hoy that means the direction of current will be from right to left in the daniel cell for these values 1.1 volt cell potential and 1 volt external voltage this is will be the direction of current next case 2 when cell potential is lower than the external voltage now cell potential is 1.1 volt for daniel cell now suppose external voltage is 1.5 volt we connect a battery of 1.5 volt to the daniel cell then since the external voltage is higher than that of the cell potential in this case so direction of current gets reversed that means the direction of current in this case now from left to right earlier we find found that direction of current was from right to left in the daniel cell but when we connect an external potential source whose voltage is higher than the cell potential then the direction of current gets reversed case 3 when cell potential becomes equal to the external potential we know that the cell potential of daniel cell is 1.1 volt now if we connect an external potential source 
of exactly 1.1 volt to the Daniel cell then no current flows that means if the cell potential becomes equal to the external voltage then no current flows that means i equal to zero so this is all about the electrochemical cell thank you